Okay, today so we're doing some alloderm grafting from uh, number 22 to 27. You can see he's got very thin tissue there, lots of recession on the cuspids. And uh, so we're going to be doing chromal positioning and alloderm grafting. And these are, I don't know, you get get some money off. So that'll be good. Yeah. You're just going for one day? Yeah. You doing okay? Mm hmm Since New Year's. Since I made those some money selling those real full tickets. Oh yeah. You didn't go into that guy? Uh -huh. I don't know. A little bit of water. You're going to feel some pushing. Mm -hmm. Oh. Some gingival on the facial. The whole... So he actually had some tooth showing left when I moved the segment. Moved the segment. Uh-huh. Just all that. Mm -hmm. So you're going to take the rest of that later? Yeah, I think we can do an immediate... Uh, an immediate provisional. Yeah. But he's changing Dennis, so I want him to see Dr. Clary first before we do anything. You doing okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, so using that modified ore band and using this little spoon, we've loosened everything up. I'm ready to put the graft in underneath. I'm going to use two pieces of alloderm here.
Okay, so we've done general swings interproximally, and because we've got another piece of graph coming in here, I'm going to do these a lot, um, next. Um, but now we're going to suture the uh, gingival margin coronally. Okay, so there's our suturing. Generally, we're doing interproximal slings and then marginal slings, what I call marginal slings, to coronally position the gingival margin. We'll take a look at this in a couple weeks. So this is a two-week healing of the alloderm grafting um, that we did from 22 to 27. And uh, we'll be taking a look at this in a couple months. Okay, so this is a two-and-a-half-month healing of the uh, alloderm grafting in the lower anterior. Number 27 had about 5 millimeters of recession, and now that's totally covered. Number 22 had 4 millimeters of recession, and that's pretty much totally covered as well. 25 and 24 had three and four millimeters of recession. There's still a little recession there, maybe one, one and a half millimeters of recession, but um, you can see that he's got thicker tissue and um, at this point we'll just kind of keep an eye on everything.